Welcome to Discover Talent friends. Uh, in this tutorial, we are going to cover how to export a data, right? Whatever data we have available in MS Excel, we are going to convert that into the XML, extended markup language, right? So how we are performing this particular task, I'll quickly show you in this particular tutorial. All right, welcome back. So this is the worksheet which I have and in this worksheet I have this data sets. This is just in a dummy data sets. Again, you can add your own data sets uh, as per your convenient. Correct. So uh, when we, you know, using the option called source, import and export. Okay, that time you need to turn on this developer tab if you don't know how to turn on this developer tab in your MS Excel so don't worry just you need to click on file more option and then options here you will get the option called customize ribbon and then right hand side you will get the developer option you might uh, have seen that you know uh, for you this option would be deactivated just click on here checkbox and then just click on the okay for me it's okay so I'll uh, start with the explanation part Correct. So exactly how it looks like the schema schema is look like this. So why we use this particular code and what is the use of this particular thing, right? XML, why we are converting that. So basically whatever data sets we have available in the Excel sheet that we can export that uh, in the any of the web application, right? Through this XML code. Correct. So that's the reason we are going to use this XML file. So record, this is this in a tag and then name name is my header right and the details which I have added just in a sample code I can say sales correct these are the headers again sales 20% and these are two entries I have added intentionally in this particular schema so based on the schema once I got these schemas right I will uh, convert this entire details entries maybe uh, details or maybe entries right if you have more than six entries you can directly create first sample one or two and then just uh, tag them in the table right and this is just in a uh, top codes which supports the uh, any of the you know of the browser right uh, so now schema I'll uh, I have saved this in the one of the location right I'll just minimize this now once you activated this developer tab you need to click on any of the cell right and then select the source option okay here you will get the option click on xml maps okay add correct uh, select your entry so wherever you have saved that particular schema right you need to select that particular file first and then open it okay okay and then select okay button okay once you do OK button, you will get the that particular schema added over here. So that this particular schema is your headers. OK, and then just select this. Drag it down. OK, sales. Drag it down. Use existing formatting or whatever you want to okay, keep. I'll just keep it as a use existing formatting and then country. OK. Now what I need to do, I need to export this particular uh, range or maybe table or whatever it's been converted right right now I need to export that into the XML so now you can see I'll click on the export option okay and then I'll give the name three and I'll just quickly export this into the XML perfect now when I open that particular file you can see earlier there were only two entries now you can see there are multiple entries and here uh, with this particular thing you can directly share this file with your client with respective stakeholder so they can analyze the data on SQL or maybe any of the web application right thanks for your time thanks for your valuable uh, support for this discovery talent presents and please subscribe my channel and give me a thumbs up on this particular tutorial thank you